show you how you can make a mask for your neck that will help to tighten and firm the neck but also get rid of the wrinkles and fine lines for it to look younger and graceful so what are you waiting for follow me to the kitchen let us whip the remedy up really really quick let's go do this Let's go do this. Our first ingredient is rice. And today I'm using some white rice. You can use black rice or even some purple rice. Rice contains skin tightening properties that will tighten and firm the skin. Not only that, it will help to reduce wrinkles and fine lines on the skin. It will also help to get rid of hyperpigmentation, an amazing ingredient to use on your skin. And it's also an ingredient that is good for most skin type. I'm going to be using a quarter cup of rice. I'm going to add this to a blender. And what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be blending it to a powder. So just add and blend blend away. Now after blending, take a look. Here we have our rice powder and what we're going to be doing with this, we're going to be using to make our neck mask. Now that our rice powder is blended, we are going to be using one third cup of the rice powder. We're going to place this in the blender since we're going to be blending. Next, I'm going to reach for some hot water. Make sure it's very hot water. And I'm going to pour about three tablespoons of the hot water in the blender. If you need a little more hot water, use another tablespoon and you're good to go give it a little star and now i'm going to reach for my third ingredient which is green tea green tea will help to smooth wrinkles and fine lines on the skin it is also very hydrating and when mixed with the rice it's going to create a powerful neck tightening facial mask so i'm using one tea bag of the green tea and i'm going to pour this in the blender along with the blended rice powder hot water and now the green tea give it a little shake and then i'm going to cover and I'm going to blend to a rice green tea cream. Now after blending, here we have our rice and green tea cream. And we're going to scoop this out in a bowl. You can store this part of the recipe in your refrigerator for up to seven days and use it up to make your homemade facial mask. So let's just scoop this out. Now this base is good to use to make several different types of facial masks. You can choose to add some yogurt, you can choose to add milk, you can even choose to add some papaya, any form of a fruit to this rice base. Now we're going to set this aside and reach for our next ingredient. Our next ingredient is banana and today I'm using a ripe banana. Banana have skin hydrating properties when applied to the skin topically. It will help to clear hyperpigmentation. However, banana also help to lighten and brighten the skin. So I'm going to use about a half of a medium banana let's cut this in two half put away another piece and we're going to be peeling our banana once the banana is peeled we're not going to toss the peel we're going to scrape the inner peel since that is where you find most of the vitamins in the banana just scrape it out this also is where you find the skin lightening properties and once we're done with that we are going to take the flesh of the banana we're going to be blending so i'm chopping it in small pieces for easier blending after we chopped we're going to place it in the blender if you do not have a blender you can choose to mash this with a fork and now we're not going to add any liquid to this. We're just going to blend this as is. So just cover and blend. Now after blending, here we have our blended banana. So what we're going to do, we're going to reach back for our rice mixture. And we're using about a tablespoon and a half to two tablespoons of the rice cream and green tea mixture. Pour this in the blender with the banana. And now we are going to cover a second time and we are going to blend. 
Now after blending, our mask is ready. We're going to store this in a small jar. Make sure it have a tight cover. Now another tip to this mask guys is that you can actually squeeze a little bit of a lemon juice to it or you can add a little bit of a lemon zest or dried orange peel to the mixture. This also is going to help it to look much lighter than its look here. This look very dark because of the banana but it is also another skin brightening properties that is low with a vitamin C however this is good just as is just if you have dark neck a little extra vitamin C would be great now give this a mix guys and this is what you're gonna be using to tighten firm and reduce wrinkles on your neck so you're gonna take a little of the mask and you're gonna apply it all the way down on your neck and your decollete. This is good, however, to use on your face. So you can completely cover your face, your neck, and the decollete with the mask and be very generous with it. This is a mask that is going to dry on the skin. So be mindful of that. While it is drying, you're going to feel a tightening sensation. Not to worry, that is the mask doing its job. Wear it on your skin for at least 30 minutes. If you have time, go a little longer and then you're going to rinse off preferably first rinse with warm water second rinse with cold water to close up back those pores now this mask is good to use two to three times per week if you want to have your skin looking amazing in no time however it is also safe to use every day on the skin go ahead guys give it a go get your neck looking clean clear and wrinkle free store in the refrigerator for up to seven days so there you have it go give this one a try don't just watch try it try it use it and come back and leave a comment thank you all and i'll see you in my next video bye bye